uh, second question. He says that every time I finish my prayer, I feel that I have this feeling of showing off, of riya, as if I did not pray for the sake of Allah Azza wa Jal. Akhi, this is from shaitan. And shaitan looks at an individual from different angles. So if the individual is loose and laxed, he will come to him and say, uh, you don't have to wash properly for wudu. You don't have to care about uh, your salat and your rak'ah. Move on. And if he sees that the individual is a little bit extreme in religion and very keen on doing things right, he comes to him and make it as an obsession that he did not do it well and he has to do more and increase and maybe go to extravagance or to extreme. He becomes a fanatic. So this is what shaitan and how shaitan works. For you, you've prayed the prayer. I ask you, who did you pray it for? You will tell me for Allah. Are you getting some cash out of it? No. Are you waiting for someone to praise you? No. Khalas. Then this is for Allah Azza wa Whatever comes afterwards, this is from shaitan. And this is why after the Prophet used to conclude his prayer, sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, he used to seek forgiveness from Allah thrice. He used to say, Astaghfirullah, Astaghfirullah, Astaghfirullah. Why are you doing this? You just pray the whole prayer. Because if there were shortcomings, if I didn't do it well, this would compensate for it. And likewise, it would compensate for such a feeling that is coming to you from shaitan. And Allah knows best.